Welcome to iFiber One's inside look at the Sage and Sun Festival. A lot's changed in the 104-year history of the festival. One thing that hasn't changed, however, is the fact it seems to draw people from all over the Pacific Northwest. I caught up with State Representative Matt Manweller as he was preparing for the parade. He said Sage and Sun is definitely one of his favorite stops during the summer. In politics, is this kind of one of the funner jobs that you might have? You know, we love going to the parades. My kids, who are right behind you, they love driving their gator. They love throwing candy. And usually the parades are associated with some type of festival, so we make a day out of it. Uh, this is one of the closer ones. It only takes us an hour to get here, but some of the ones out in Reardon and Lincoln County, it's like a all day, three hours both way. But, you know, we'll do the parade, and then we'll hang out afterwards and, you know, go to the farmer's market, buy some lunch. You know, it's fun. You got the whole family down today? Do I have my wife Shelly, I got my son Grayson and my other son Lincoln, and they are my big helpers. They, uh, they drive the truck, they carry the candy, and they throw most of the candy. Most of it? They eat the other half. Yeah. <laughs> they eat the other half. Yes, they will both be passed out in the car on the way home from a sugar crash, right? It mysteriously disappears. Matt certainly knows his way around the Sage and Sun Festival. The farmer's market is always a hit, and it was nearly cleaned out by the time I got there. That's all right, though, because a guy like me can't survive on healthy food alone. If you're like me, and I know I am, you end up making a few stops to the food court for a snack or lunch or dinner. All right, I admit it, I had breakfast there, too, but I needed to load up. I was very busy. But I found out I wasn't as busy as my next guest, who was a contestant on Simon Cowell's show, The X Factor. Lacey Ryan is an incredible singer who just started her modeling career. Uh, you're performing at the Sage and Sun Festival yes, here. I am. I'm performing at Sage and Sun at 6.30. And you're, you're kind of busy. Yes. You've got, you, you've been on the show The X Factor. Yes, I have. I was on X Factor about two or three years ago. And you're a model. Yes, yes. I have been modeling for about, I would say, eight months. And I miss music so much, so it's really good to be performing today. Is music your first love? Music, music is the air I breathe. Yeah. It's, it's my main, most beautiful passion. Gosh, yes, yes. I've heard you sing before. I've seen some, uh, a few clips yeah. from a couple years ago. And so you, you've got the, the music thing going. Yeah. And you're, you're a model. Yes. And you still have to finish high school this next year you're going to be a senior yes i'm going to be a senior next year it's, yeah you have got a lot of irons in the fire here i have a lot of irons in the fire but you know you have to hit it while you're young and and do as much as you can and be as ambitious and follow your dreams work as hard as you can and you do work hard i mean with all this stuff i mean how much practice have you put in just just singing it and preparing just singing? oh my gosh hours hours and hours I mean it takes it takes everything you have you know my grandpa God rest his soul when he was alive he always told me you have to you have to eat and sleep it and it really is true everything goes towards your dreams a hundred percent a hundred and fifty percent you know Julene, Julene, Julene. Jolene, I'm begging of you, please don't take my man. So, what's it like doing modeling? Um, that I mean, because that's such a, such a contrast to to performing. It really is, you know. Uh, it's a hard world modeling. It, it's a very cruel, yeah. uh, cutthroat world. So. And you're so nice. How do you do it? Yeah, you know, someone told me you should be a model, and I said, oh, okay, I'll try it. I'll try it out. But it, it's very difficult. It's very difficult, but I do stick with it because it does help with my music, getting indoors with music and promoting. And Yes, and I do enjoy the arts of it. Yeah, you know, and you've got a, a terrific video on your Facebook page. You. Check it out, everyone. Yeah, Lacey, Lacey Ryan, Facebook page. <laughs> Yep. All right. So what's what's next for you? Do you have a busy summer coming up we, between singing and modeling? or? I'm trying to kind of plan a little mini tour right now and between the Northwest to Portland, Seattle, Spokane, 
and then yes lots of modeling shoots and things will just keep progressing and yeah I'm working as hard as I can so Lacey thank you so much you. talented young lady and uh, she's going to be uh, kind of our headliner tonight, uh, our last day of the, the festival. And you, you go on at about 6.30. 6.30, yes. Come and watch. Come down and enjoy some awesome booths and some my awesome music. And it is awesome. Jolene, 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 I'm begging of you. Please don't take my man He talks about you in his sleep And there's nothing I can do to keep from crying when he calls Stay tuned. When we come back, you're going to see me attempt to interview two professional comedians. Don't laugh. It's not as easy as you might think. <laughs> 